University Tun Usin on Malaysia Electromagnetic Compatibility Centre is started in 2001. It is the first accredited government agency EMC test lab. Wearable applications is one of the prominent field of research which is being conducted here. What are wearable applications? Why carry your tag when you can wear it? It is the practice behind wearables. The latest compact devices that can be wrapped on your wrist, worn around your neck, slip on your finger or place on your head. It is for fitness, fashion, connectivity and entertainment. Okay, uh, there are lots of uh, wearable devices. Nowadays, you can find uh, smart watches, you can find smart uh, sunglasses, all these uh, gadget need to have a uh, connectivity with the existing network, such as uh, wireless LAN or even cellular network. So, basically, one of the important key elements to allow this connectivity is in the antenna design. And why the antenna design is important here is basically we need to actually design antenna that suitable to be put on our body applications. Uh, and we know that these on body applications they need to bear or not that sensitive with any uh, body curvature or movement of a body. So therefore, we actually narrowing down our antenna design by utilizing uh, Plana Adapo Antenna which is fabricated on semi-flexible material so it's fit the purpose on as a wearable uh, application. Hello everyone! The dipole antenna design is plana compared to the uh, commercial monopole antenna. So uh, it functions as a receiver which receives signal at 2.45 GHz. The connectivity is established using the uh, XB module and this is the transmitter which is imitating as a Wi-Fi network uh, in, this, uh, in the testing platform. And this is the receiver. So uh, the variable antenna design is attached to the receiver so that it can receive the signal from the transmitter. So these are the functions of the variable antenna design. Thank you. The vector network analyzer is used for the measurement of written loss and frequency response of the designed variable antenna. The anechoic chamber at the EMC center is used for the radiation pattern measurement of the variable antenna design. The received signal strength indication measurement is taken using XCTU software and XB module as a transmitter and receiving end. And the setup is done using a laptop and setup is shown in the video right now. And this is the RSSI measurement taken and it, it changes according to the distance the antenna is moved from the transmitter.